Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you are new here, hi, hello. My name is Shauna Marshall. Welcome on in. I already know you're going to enjoy your time here. So please make sure to hit that subscribe button and that post notification bell so you're notified every single time I upload a video. Also follow me over on Twitter and on TikTok at Shauna Marshall YT. The names will be in the description box below. Hey guys, we are back with another episode of Omina. Y'all already know the past episode was crazy. So if y'all have not watched it, just go watch it. I will link it here in the eye. I cannot give y'all an update on what happened because it was just that crazy. So I'm going to need for y'all to go and watch it and then come to this episode. So you are all caught up and nothing is confusing to you. So let's get into it. I'm not going to talk a whole lot. So my girl went on and opened her store. And she's been open since about 11 o'clock this morning. Um, I think it's currently about 7, 6 or 7, something like that. But anyway, we about to get rid of the clothes. But when I tell y'all, we open up the store at about 11 or 12, somewhere, somewhere in there. And this fellow that's standing behind Amina has been here ever since we opened. And they just been like talking, but he ain't bought nothing. So I'm like, bro. If you're not going to buy none, I'm going to need for you to leave. But yeah, this is why she got this little sly freaking look on her face and this grin because, you know, what? I don't even know why. Because Amina just been going crazy lately without me even doing anything. She just look, she, she she got a mind of her own. She's been doing her own thing. So I've just been letting her live and doing whatever she needs to do. <laughs> whatever she feel is right. i just been letting her go for it. So anyway, we are getting close to closing up up um so we can freaking head home because it's getting late and my girl needs to deal with her babies and t tyena i'm not even in a hurry to deal with that but anyway let's get into it okay so currently 7 12 my girl is getting hungry anyway we still have quite a few people in the store so i'm trying to see if they're gonna wrap it up and leave and y'all so, somebody tell me why omar got fired i'm at the store uh, oh, yeah, we fired we fired our employee, y'all, because she, she just wasn't doing what she needed to do. But anyway, we at the store working, and it says, bad news, Omar was fired from his job. How he get fired? Like, this is the last thing we need, and we got a freaking grandkid on the way, even though they don't know that part yet. All right, it don't look like they about to buy nothing, so I'm about to close up shop because... Oh my God, my girl did so good today. So people bought her paintings and you know, her paintings, they was like, they was about 25 or so hundred dollars or something like that. We only made three sales and made that much. Man, I can't wait until people actually like come in here and buy like for real. Bro, why are you waving? You need to go. You, you need to go with not, not having no clothes on. Goodbye. Goodbye, ma'am. I'm about to say, like, go. Oh. No, we don't need to browse no books. I mean, are we about to lock up, lock up the store. Uh, lock store for everyone, but Amina. Let me make sure we don't have anything to clean up before we head home. Okay, I think I had her clean earlier. Yeah, because her employee, she wasn't doing nothing. So we had to freaking fire her. Oh, crap. Let me cut these lights off. Because, child, who needs who needs a high freaking bill? Not us. Okay, we back. And not hugging home and then feeling angry. It's personal. Everyone seems to love a people personal like Amina. So, if this friendship fell apart, then it has to be that other Sam's fault, right? Child, Amina, we don't, we don't have time, baby. Okay. Now, why did you lose your job, dude? What happened to you? Nothing gets Sims down like losing a job. I'm trying to figure out how did you lose your job when you was at work? Oh, my God. All right. Let me check on everybody. Why are you sitting here and you need to go to the restroom? You, so you just going to use it on yourself. Let me cheat that because the last thing I need is for her to freaking get up and then use it on my floor. Oh, my God. I mean, I come in here and cook these kids something to eat. What is... This house, Amina's household is so out of control. 
Amina's household is just out of control. I'm really going to have to start hiring a freaking uh, nanny. Girl, come in here and cook up something that's going to last for a while. Like, I don't care what you cook. It needs to be something that's going to, that, that's about to, la- yep, right there. Cook, cook, cook that. That look like that should last for a while. These doggone kids. And what is this one doing? What is you wearing? This is the problem. Need clothes. This this here this here is the problem right here. Dressing like she grown. And who is crying? What do you need, baby? He's sad why? Someone smashed his freaking dollhouse. Is it this? Okay. All right. Time right or angry no girl, who got time? Uh repair that for your brother. Okay, there you go. Okay, now he's happy now that you're repairing that for him. Okay. Tristan is the only one that's acting like he got some sins, even though he be out here in the pool 24-7. We just gone. We're going to ignore him. Okay. Omar cooked that, so anybody who's hungry right now can eat this. I don't care. Tristan, come on, you hungry. Why can't you grab a serving? Can't do this while inside the pool. Boy, that's why I'm telling you to get out of the pool. Come grab you a serving. Um, Trinity. Come get you some food, mama. Everybody, everybody come get some food. Okay. What are you doing with him? Put him down. He can get his own food. We don't have time for high chairs. He can get his own freaking food. Y'all know y'all don't do high chairs. Y'all, psh, it's too late. We don't do hot chairs. Not him with an attitude. Send you back to your mama, little bass. <laughs> what? And what is you in here talking about, Onyx? Okay, baby, Onyx. Like, okay. Get, boy, get up and get you some food, too. Get over here and grab you some food because you're going to have to tell Amina that. You've lost your freaking job. Knowing that you know that we was looking for that job. Okay. They want us to post some social bunny stuff. We can do that. Uh, Let's see. What's been going on? I didn't think nothing been going on for her to post nothing. New post. Post a book review. Sure. Let's do a happy narrative. Post about travel. Uh, Energized narrative. Okay. And the book review was a happy narrative. All right. We ain't got no friends. We need some friends. Uh, Justin. Uh, Jefferson, even though he really don't like us because he did not want Omar to be with Amina. Uh, who else? Taina, so we can see what she up to. Oh, she going she gonna friend Miles, y'all. She gonna friend Miles. Wait, we got two miles? Ain't, ain't her stalker miles too, child? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Maybe we shouldn't have befriended that miles. <laughs> like, Grandma Diane, for sure. Uh, Let's see. Nah, we're going to leave miles alone. Carter, remember, he was our attorney. And... Is that it? Omar ain't on here? Child. Please put Miles away. Oh, our sister. Ardrina, of course. Their relationship still ain't that good. Like, they barely see each other, barely talk, barely do anything. Okay. Maybe tomorrow is when I will let this little girl here. She may just tell her mama first. And then... I, yeah, I don't know how I want to do it. She may tell her mama and Omar first, and then her mama will have to take her over to Drew to break the news to Drew. And then they, she gonna have to tell these folks who this baby is about, child. I'm not even looking forward to that. All right, let's have. Which kid is up? Okay, you up? Good. Come and put this away. Like y'all need to start doing y'all freaking chores. Stop talking. Stop talking. Okay. Put that away. And then where are those burgers? Come and put this away. 
Okay, Amina's tired. Omar is tired. Um, Omar, when you get done with that, you can come back in your room because y'all are still not sleeping in the same bed yet. I need for their, uh, how is their romance, right? How is it this down? <gasps> what happened? Bro, y'all was on the up and up. How did it get down this far? Oh, when they argued about, oh boy. Oh my God. <sighs> It just keeps getting worse. It just keeps. Their relationship literally just keeps getting worse. Like. Oh my God. Okay. Um, Amina, come and put Onyx to bed. So put Onyx Amir right on the bed. Look, girl. Don't y'all got school tomorrow? Like, can't you go talk to your brother? Oh, he sleep too. My bad. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, pretty. But you need to go to sleep with your little snaggle tooth. Come and uh, go to sleep because you got school in the morning. Okay. Put his little self to bed and then you could come and go to sleep yourself. Okay, y'all. These two here are up and I have no idea why, but I'm glad that they are because what I didn't realize is that she only got four hours until she's in her second trimester. So I got to say that like, it's just nagging her so bad until she has to go in here and freaking wake Amina up because you know, in the second trimester, that's when the parent automatically knows. So I'm gonna have her go in here and be like, mom, I need to talk to you. I'm sorry. I don't mean to wake you up. But there's something that I have to tell you. Like, because she's about to freaking find out anyway. I didn't even realize it. Not Amina just waking up like it's just fine. Let, okay, y'all. Yeah, okay, y'all tripping about the what you call. Okay, we got to do laundry. Calm down. Dang. Okay, laundry gone. Y'all good? Chill out. Okay. You got to tell them, mama. We don't have, we literally don't have no more time to waste. And I forgot how to do it. I don't even think she could do it. Can she do it? If she's a teen? Teenager? So it may not work. So I'm just going to have to have her go ahead and announce the unwanted pregnancy. Oh my God, my girl got to use it. Okay, 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 okay. Because I don't need you going crazy. I don't need you going crazy. Oh my God, look at my girl's face. First off, she looks so sad and scared already. She's like, mama, I just woke you up because I needed a hug. And plus I got something that I really need to tell you. <laughs> not, not you sitting down. Not her having to sit down to tell her. She's like, I'm sorry. I just gotta, I gotta sit down. First off, not you coming over here to sit down to tell her. I'm so dead. <laughs> my seals is a true. Oh my God, it looked like Amina is pissed. She's so upset. She's looking like you got to be kidding me, Taina. How could you do this? How could you be this irresponsible? She's like, I'm sorry. It says teenage child pregnant. The Sim has just learned about their teenage child being pregnant. Will they react well and offer support or react poorly and refuse to be supportive? I think she's going to react poorly because she's been talking to Taina and talking to Taina and Taina refuses to listen. Taina has been thinking that she's grown. So I think she's going to react poorly. Not about to pass out. I mean, it's like I'm about to be sick. She's like, I'm about to be sick. I cannot take this. I can't believe you're this irresponsible. Ugh. Okay. No, I'm saying okay. <laughs> okay. All right, so it says this disastrous news. Anger and panic take over Amina's mind as she tries to integrate what she just learned. Her teenage child pregnant. What sort of madness, what levels of recklessness and responsibility plague her child for them to let such a thing happen? 
oh my god see this here is why uh tiana never told her mama remember tiana never told her freaking mama um but then tiana also had a miscarriage in her very first trimester because she was so freaking stressed out oh my god okay girl let's let you go ahead and go to the restroom and then take a shower and then let's check up on tiana because i think we're gonna keep her home from school and we're gonna make her go and uh tell her dad too all right let's see what is she up to okay now you need to go out here and tell what is you trying to do no you're not about to cry nothing out all right let's come and tell uh he probably won't care though child he don't be caring i don't even think we could tell him yeah we can i lied like he he probably gonna be like really you tell your mama what she say <laughs> okay come on out here let's tell omar let's see what he has to say look at him he has been knowing these kids ever since they were freaking babies these are his kids he said too everybody <laughs> she's like i know i don't know what to do omar mama is not supportive she's freaking out in there she's like i just don't know what to do okay let's um okay express your feelings she he's like okay i can talk to her about this but we gotta plan something like how could you do this tyena she's like i don't know i don't know what to do she's like i need for you to talk to mom she all in the shower let me put the walls up she's like okay then she's making me go and tell dad like i don't know she's like thank you omar if you talk to her i really appreciate it he's like okay i got you i probably will talk to her you know when she calmed down a little bit because she probably looked too upset right now <laughs> what is this afraid of the dark boy if you don't get your overgrown butt not her standing here waiting for Tiny to come in. Look how she look. Is she mad at everybody? She like Tristan. What do you want? <laughs> She's Tyena is done with these kids. She's over it. She's over it, baby. She turned and walked away so fast. Like uh, you know what? I can't. I can't even deal with y'all. Okay, lecture her about her freaking responsibilities because they are about to change drastically. Where are you going, little girl? Where is you going, little girl? No, you're not crying nothing out. Tina's like, let me get on. I mean, Amina's like, let me get on up the, these stairs and tell this little girl things are about to be different. The freedom that she has, she don't have it no more. Why you sounding so sweet when you talk? I mean, I'm such a sucker, bro. Like in real life, she is just like such a sucker. I just, I can't. And now she want to look mean, but you didn't look mean when you were fussing. Oh my God. Okay, Amina, is that all you gotta? Is that all you need to say, girl? You'll be okay. She will be okay. Okay, like we gonna help her, but we gonna tell her that you know. No, we're not gonna kick her out. Oh, ask if the child's father will stay. Let's bring up the child's father, Tyena. Oh, my God. My girl is just like really about to pass out. She's like, okay. And about this daddy? Who, who's the father? She's like, I can't. I, I don't. I don't know. She's like, I don't know about him yet. Tristan, baby, you are in dangerous territory. He like, ooh, Tyena in trouble. <laughs> you get your butt in your room right now. There is no need for you to be smack dab in the middle of this conversation. Goodbye. She's like, I don't know because I haven't told him anything about it yet. She's like, what do you mean he doesn't know? Okay, well, then maybe I need to go over there and speak to his parents. She's like, he doesn't have any parents, mom. She's like, what are you talking about? He doesn't have any parents. She's like, well, I mean, he's grown. You know, he, he lives on his own. 
is she? I mean, it's like, wait, wait, what? Yell at her. She's like, wait, what? Wait until your father hears about this. She is like, wait until your father hear about this. You need to go and shower. Get yourself ready because you're about to go with it. Let's say just let it go. Taina can't help but feel frustrated about Amina clinging to the other side of that argument. In a perfect world, they both would have just let it rest and talked about something else. What? I mean, you could dislike arguments, but what the... Y'all, when I tell y'all time, I think she's grown. She's like, Mom, I just don't understand why you still bugging. Like, it is what it is. I don't know what else I could say. Then look how she looking. Look how she's looking. She's like, I mean, I don't know what else you want me to tell you. So, it has already happened. Um, We've been together for a while now. Yes, he's grown, but he's only like four or five years older than me. So, like, if I was 18, this wouldn't be a problem. And I'll be 18 in two years. So, I really don't see the problem. She's like, I don't I don't get it. Like, you continue to argue over the same thing. Why? Like, wh- what's the reason? Oh. Y'all, Amina is like, I'm real close to kicking you out, Taina. Like, I'm so close to throwing you over there with your daddy. You don't even realize it. Fuzak. She's like, you're driving me absolutely crazy. I've worked so hard to make sure that y'all don't go down the same path I do. <gasps> Not a- Bro, Amina, Amina, I don't know. You need to freaking just grab this little girl and roll her down every single step. Every single step. I mean, I know that you can't. Because apparently, like, they don't allow you to put your hands on these children. <laughs> and look, she can't even discipline her for yelling. What? She can help her with her needs. She can influence her to do things. But you're telling me she can't put her in her place for yelling and acting crazy? Like, I need somebody to make a mod. That really can be putting kids in their place. Like smack them when they start talking crazy. That's what I need. That's what I need. Like we're not done with you. Talking about some you sick of arguing over the same thing. Well we gonna continue to do it. We gonna continue to do it. All these other kids y'all need to go and go to school. I mean, it's like, are you crazy? This is what I've worked so hard for. To make sure y'all don't go down the same path that I went down. But here you go, Taina. She's like, you do realize Tiana was pregnant too, right? But I don't remember this big debacle when it was her. She's like, yeah, because I didn't find out until after she miscarried. But she made sure to get her life together. She's like, you know what? Just get your stuff ready so you can go. Send alone. No, 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 no. Because you ain't going. You're not going. You going over there to tell your father now that you're pregnant. She's like, go get in the shower. Go get ready, Taina. I have nothing else that I need to say to you. She's like, I'm so sick of this. Like, Taina's like, I'm. this is just like getting so old. I don't even have time. Like, I'll go get in the shower. It is what it is. She's like, okay, then go. She's like, then why are you still standing here in front of me? Go and get in the shower and go and get dressed. She's like, oh my God, this girl. She's like, she drives me insane. <laughs> okay, while we got Taina getting ready, let's have my girl come on down here and get her some leftovers. Um, Let's have Omar call. A, well, actually, we don't need a freaking nanny because... He got fired. So he could stay with the children. Um, I don't have I I don't ha uh have the preschool mod in my game anymore. I thought I did, but I forgot I took it out because a lot of those mods was really messing on my game and causing it to lag and just go crazy. I don't know. Everything was updated, like I didn't have any old um mods in, but they continue to just 
make my ga- gag, make my game lag, and everything else. So I just don't have time for it. So I just took it all out. I took it all out. Okay, you don't need to talk to your mama. Come in here and use the restroom. That's all we need from you. Okay? That's literally it. Okay. Do we still have time for her second trimester? Oh, she's in her second trimester? Bro, it didn't even look like it. Single parent. Oh, my God. What does that say? Single parent. It was hard to tell another Sam about not having a serious romantic partner all the while being pregnant. Taina couldn't help feeling ashamed. As you should. As you should. The girl don't even look like she in her second trimester, though. Girl, period. That That's not a good thing, though. That's that's not a good thing. My bad. Okay. We don't have time for you to eat. You'll be okay. Okay. Amina, let's take this chick over there to her dad. So she could tell her dad and her stepmama, even though Amina don't like the stepmama, but whatever. Um, Where, where the heck is she? Here she go. Omar, you better take care of these freaking babies. What is wrong with you, Amina? Like... Ever since she told my girl this news, she just she has just been beside herself. Okay, we are here. And look what she wears. Y'all, this girl here thinks she's so freaking grown. And she look grown. It look like she should be Amina's freaking friend or something. Like, oh my god. Okay. Alright, so we are at Drew's house. Let's go on and knock on this door. So we can get this started. Amina, go! She like, "Uh uh-huh, come on in here so you can tell your father. She's like, do I have to? Like, I just don't have... Not her going to order food, girl. You ain't hungry. Come on. I'll cheat it. Get your butt in this house. Oh, Lord. It's Ashanti. Okay. Okay. All right. So, everybody here. Drew don't want to put no drawers on, I guess. I mean, no pants on, I guess. Okay. So, uh, Ashanti and Amina, they're, you know, they're, they're cordial now. They didn't let their little issues be what it is. You know, they didn't move on. But anyway, let me go ahead and take control of him. And, of course, this little Missy Missy right here is... Their other sister, this is Ashanti and Drew's baby. Baby, but where is your where are your pants at? Okay. Let's let's fix this. Let's fix this, please. Put that on. Like, and let me save because y'all know my game is crazy. Alright. Take a control of him. Now. Come on, girl. Ain't no point of you being sad. Ain't no point of you being sad. She a mom, she, you know, she a daddy's girl. She has a Now, y'all know Taina has been the one that has always been the daddy's girl. Does he know? Because she's, she's pregnant now. So, does she, does he know? He still doesn't know. He's like, hey, baby, how you doing? She's like, I'm good. She's like, I'm good. I just, I had to come over here to tell you something. He's like, you know, you can tell me anything. What's up? You could have called me, but I don't mind you coming over. He's like, so what's up? He was like, oh, you coming over here to tell me that you want that car? You want some money? What you want? She's like, no, I'm actually pregnant. Ooh. But he's like, not nah, my baby. Not. No, you not. Of course, he, he of course, he going to react well and accept support. Because again, when I tell y'all. Taina can do no wrong in Drew's eyes. They have been close. Always close. Always close. Tiana and Drew, however, they have a little bit of a love-hate relationship because, you know, she was around for everything that he did to Amina. So, but uh, T- Taina was a little smaller. So, she don't know everything. So, I feel like he's going to react well and he's going to offer support. And she's like, thank you. Like, mom is not taking it well. She's like, yeah, I shouldn't have to take it well. Oh, Lord. He's like, uh, Amina, can I talk to you for a minute? She's like, I don't know why, but okay. He's like, it's fine. Let me just let me just talk to you for a minute. 
All right, so it said, quite the news. Shock takes over Drew's mind as he tries to integrate what he has just learned. His teenage child pregnant. What sort of madness? Ha- okay, it says the same thing. Got it. <laughs> I'm not about to read this twice. <laughs> He's like, yo, Amina, let me just let me just talk to you for a minute, please. Can you come upstairs so we could talk? And she's like, okay, sure, Drew, we can uh, we can talk. All right, let's have them just head upstairs in the hallway. Um, or actually, let's have them go in the back. They can go in the backyard. All right, so you go here, and Amina, you come on, and you go here too. And girl, you not about to lay in nobody's freaking bed. You can have a seat. Actually, go ahead. Go ahead. Tell Ashanti too. Might as well. Go ahead and tell everybody. All right. So these two, let's come on out here. Girl, boy, your baby's fine. Go here. He's like, so this is some crazy news, huh? She's like, you telling me these two, I haven't had them on screen together in a minute. At least talking anyway. It's been, a, it's been a while. Share worries. He's like, man, I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen with this. Like, oh my God, y'all, their relationship is so good now. Boy, why did you put this back on? Though? Why? Like, Why? Why? Is this supposed to be your summer wear? Where are your clothes? Oh my God. Give me this. Copy this outfit. Like. And put it on your freaking summer wear. Jesus Christ. All right. Wow. She's like, I know it's been a minute since we talked. He's like, all right, so, like, I'm worried about this. Like, this is some crazy crap. What we going to do? She's like, I know. And she won't listen to anything that I have to say. Then she's talking about this man is grown. Like, he's not even a teenager. Drew is like, wait, what? She's like, yeah. This is a grown man that has gotten our baby pregnant. And apparently, he doesn't even want to be in the baby's life. Drew is like, you've got to be kidding me. This is crazy. He's like, nah, I need to find out who this guy is. She's like, I agree. She's like, I think that Tyena should call him over here so we all can have a conversation. Drew like, you know what? That that sounds good to me. He was like, where Omar? She's like, he's at home. She's like, maybe he should be here too. Not you still over here. Child. Okay. Um... I'm going to leave Omar home. Like, Omar just... Ciao. Oh, no! Wake up! Wake up! You are being made to call a dude over here. So, you got to get you gotta get him on over here. And he want to go cry. Everybody want to cry or do something. No, we not crying nothing out. You going to come and sit down. Uh, You could go and sit there. Okay, did it say he would be right over? Okay, cool. I guess Omar does need to be here. I mean, this is this is like his freaking daughter too. So let's just uh, let's get Omar over here. I was supposed to be freaking having a barbecue, but because she was going into her second trimester so uh quick, I didn't have I didn't have time to do it. Omar would rather not come. Oh my god, like. Omar, we don't even have time to do it. <laughs> See, this is why she be flirting another dude's faces, bro. This right here is why. This is freaking why. Alright, where does this dude at? And here he is. Uh, and then she gonna take her butt back to sleep? No, ma'am. No, ma'am. Alright, I'm gonna have her pretend like she just ran out here. So she just ran out here because she know they coming. Like, she know they coming. <laughs> Girl, where you at? Okay. So she gonna greet him. She gonna be like, hey, how you doing? Like my, my, my family wanted me to, you know, bring you uh over call you over here. And he's like, for what? 
He like, why they, why they need me to come over here for? Share the pregnancy news, girl. She like, well, this is why. And what type of eyelashes you got on? Why y'all changing y'all stuff? Like, who told who told him to put on these eyelashes? Because I know doggone well that ain't what I had him on. Okay? Just copy this outfit. <laughs> Look at how he looking at it already. That's my... <laughs> she ain't even showed him nothing. And he like, uh, what's this? He like, w w w w what's this? Okay, outfit, please, paste. Dang. Okay, all right. Bro, he's looking like, M what are you trying to tell me right now? She's like, well, this is it. <gasps> well, this show ain't how Tiana's was. <laughs> He's like, this can't be like. <laughs> Not both of them crying at the same time. Oh, my girl is hot. My girl is hot. She about to come right on out here. She about to come on right on out here. Rude introduction. A rude freaking introduction. And you know Drew about to go crazy. Not him yelling at her. He's, she's like, Dion, I know. I thought I didn't know that this was going to happen. I didn't try to make this happen. He's like, bro, I can't even talk to you right now. She's like, are you crazy? Don't be talking to my daughter crazy. She was like, you are a grown man. And you got the nerve to come here yelling at her? He's like, and excuse me, who are you? I'm her mother. That's who I am. Taina, this is who you're dating? A guy like this? She was like somebody who clearly doesn't respect you. He only wanted you for one thing and that's it. He's like, listen, lady, you don't know nothing about me. Not him, not her trying to ease it over. Like, come on, guys. It's okay. It's okay. D uh, Drew came out like, we got a problem here? Vanilla the door. He like we we got a problem here. Are you trying to talk to my daughter crazy? He like you trying to talk to my daughter crazy, and you the one who put her in this position. I think you need to lower your tone, bro. They like Taina go inside. <laughs> Did y'all see how Drew looked at Taina? He like you need to go inside. You don't need to be out here right now. Not him already about to throw a drink. Period. Let's get into it. Let's get into it. He like, Amina, don't get yourself worked up over this food because I swear he better not act crazy. He said he better not act crazy. Not here because he don't know who I am. Drew like, first off, you don't, you shouldn't have been around my daughter. You are a grown tail man. Why were you around my daughter? <laughs> He like, well, your daughter wasn't acting like she was no freaking teenager. He said she wasn't acting like she was no kid. He said your daughter was acting like a grown woman, and that's what I treated her like. He like, Drew is like, wait a minute, what did he say? He like, what did he say? Dion is sitting here like, yeah, y'all ain't doing number talk, but I guarantee you she going to be calling me. Y'all can sit here. Y'all can yell. Y'all can do all y'all want to do to her. But I promise you she going to be calling me. She going to be calling me. Drew is like, you better keep my daughter's name out your mouth. Like, this going to be the last time you ever talk to her. I promise you that. Not not Amina just moving on out the way. She just like, uh-huh, Drew, handle that. <laughs> she just like, Drew, handle that. He was like, you got one more time to talk about my daughter, playboy. She ain't going to never be calling you again. Because I promise you, she ain't going to need nothing from you. We got her. You going to stay away from my daughter. He said, you going to stay away from my daughter. Oh, Drew, baby. I should. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Look, Amina, man. Amina said, I knew you wouldn't <laughs> I mean, let's say the only thing you can do is put your hands on a woman. You can't even fight a man. You can't even fight a man. 
Amina's so mad, bro. Amina is so mad. She's like, I knew you couldn't do nothing right. She's like, oh, this is ridiculous. Drew, <laughs> Drew, I think we need a rematch, bro. I ain't even gonna lie. Now he's talking about he dazed. He dazed. Drew, come on now. You can't be letting him go out like that. You can't be letting him go out like that. He was talking about your daughter. He got your 16-year-old daughter pregnant, Drew. And then come talking about it don't matter what y'all say. It don't matter what y'all do. She gonna be calling me. And then gonna say that she wasn't acting grown. I mean, acting like a child. She was acting like she grown. So that's what I treated her like. Come on, Drew. Drew. Okay, thank God. Thank God. I mean, you should have won the first time, though. Like, Amina win the first time. Omar won the first time. And, Drew, it took you two times. Okay, but I get it. I mean, he muscular. So, I get it. I get it. I get it. Bro, it's the fact. Look at Amina. <laughs> Amina's like, uh-huh. What, what you got to say now? What you got to say now, Dion? What is it? What you need to say now? Oh, my God. This has been some dysfunctional stuff. This is dysfunctional. Can they bring up um, the kid in any way? Okay, they can't. So, you know what? They just going to tell him, you need to get up off my property. Don't ever call my daughter again. Don't be around her again. Because we letting you off easy. Next time, we going to call the cops. I mean, it's like, oh, my God. What do we do now? She's like, because he's right. We can't control this girl. She's like, she's getting out of control. Um, Drew is like, I know, I know. He's like, I mean, what do you suggest? Like, what what can we do? She's like, I don't know. But all I do know is long as she's pregnant with this guy's baby, you know that she's going to do any and everything that she can. She's like, he's like, yeah, but you know, Taina is usually all talk. She's like, no, what Taina want to do, Taina will do it. He's like, well, maybe she should stay here. She's like, oh, no. You too soft. He's like, you too soft. You let her do whatever she wants. She was like, well, we can't just lock her up. He's like, well, maybe we should. I just think we need to get, you know, a little more strict. Ah, uh, Tiana. Oh, listen, Tiana didn't heard about all the drama. Now she want to call. She's like, okay, I just got to get straight. Like, sh she can't go anywhere. She needs to go to school, doctor, home. That's it. And Drew is like, I mean, I agree. I'm in agreement with you. When she come here, that's all it's going to be. School, doctor, home. I mean, it's like, I'm glad we understand each other. Oh, my God. My girl is so pissed. My girl is so pissed. The principal's calling. Don't nobody care about the principal. Like, we got an A. We got an A. What is she out here doing? Oh, she in here talking to her sister. Okay. Anyway, let's go ahead and stop controlling Drew. Um, Drew and Taina is going to have to have a heart-to-heart, -heart, though. But it won't be right now. Like, my girl... I mean, I ain't got time for it. I mean, it's like, you know what? I just need to get back to the house, not take a vacation. <laughs> you do. You do need one. No mama. No lie. <laughs> okay. Uh, not with Drew, but where is that freaking Taina? Get your butt on. Let's get to this house because you about to be on lockdown. Lockdown. All right. Amina is like you in the house now. She's like, mama, I'm hungry. She's like, okay. Go in there, go and get you some food. But after that, me and you going through your closet. She's like, my closet? She's like, go get you some food first, Taina. What is this now? Our child is in trouble from worrying about child. Amina and her partner are saddened at their teen child's pregnancy situation. Whether they are supportive or not, they are both troubled over this for sure. Oh, my God. <sighs> Jesus Christ. Yes, girl. Go get yourself like a pep talk or something. Carol, Taina, see, you just a child. We're going to have to have you go and talk to Tiana. Like, 
because baby this is just bad okay what's wrong with y'all to why are you girl i'm about to say go to sleep why every time i'm here i come back and my kids is like about to freaking die oh she's like it's gonna be okay sis she's like thank you tristan he's like yeah you know i got you Okay, go on in there and get you some freaking leftovers. Let me cheat your sister's stuff before she freaking pass out. And then when she get up from her nap or sleep, whatever she doing, she gonna need to um uh take a take a shower. Uh, Omar, I need for you to get up here and take these kids a bath because I'm not gonna be able to do it right now because we about to go through uh this girl's freaking closet she about to stop dressing like she 23 okay talent needs to be first and i don't understand why she do not she don't sleep no more girl no 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 i don't need you going in here C come and get in the shower in there she will not sleep she only sleeps literally for like 10 minutes and i don't i don't i don't know why okay when you get done with that mama let's have you go ahead and use the restroom go and use the restroom and then amina is gonna meet you upstairs she already gonna be in your room she gonna be in your room sitting right here and then when you get done you need to go right on up there we're gonna pretend like you're going straight through your closet and we about to change every single outfit amina is like there is no more of this all of this provocative freaking dressing you gotta have stuff that's so tight on you you could barely sit down Amina said no more of that. Okay, he got his bath. Cool. All right. Um, Omar, come and do some laundry, bro. Like, is this door? Oh, she got this freaking door locked. Okay, that's okay. No more locked doors for her either. Unlock. Yep, she didn't lost that privilege. So whoever want to walk in here can walk in here whenever they get good and ready. All right. Come on in there and sit down, Amina. Omar, come on and do some laundry. Why can you not add it to the washing machine? Oh, we got stuff in the washing machine. Okay. Unload and add to dryer. She's like, so what is it, mom? She's like, yeah, we about to go through your drawer. She said, we about to change every single outfit that you're wearing. She said, that little crap that you had on today? She said, no more of that. So let's go through your drawer. Let's find you some clothes. She's like, are you serious? She's like, does it look like I'm joking? I mean, it's like, does it look like I'm joking? Get in your closet and let's find you different clothes to wear. She's like, oh my God, I cannot believe you're doing this right now. Like you're doing too much. All right. So basically, Amina is going to be looking at every single outfit that my girl wears and she's going to be trying to change it. If she think it's okay, then that's fine. But some of this stuff like this one here, this is fine. We don't want her to dress, you know, like she a nun or nothing like that. This here, this is fine. Why she actually look bigger in this? Like, why does that make her look so big? I don't know. That's weird. Anyway okay what is this one this one is fine let's keep it pushing i think it's the freaking hot wear that's the pro yep nope this this ain't gonna work no more this is not gonna work no more mm. i think that one is fine but this one here no we may can keep the shorts but the shirt is a no-go we need to start she need to start wearing clothes that covers her up so I'm going to go through here. I'm going to find her some more freaking clothes and then we'll be back. Okay. So my girl is finally done. She has changed her clothes. Well, the ones that Amina thought was provocative. Okay. So like I said, she changed the ones that have been provocative, which actually wasn't that many. I think it was only like two or three. So all of her everyday wear, Amina was like, you know what? That's fine. It's not extremely revealing like those other ones were. So she know that her daughter is a teenager. So swimming suits that don't matter. But the clothes that she was wearing for hot weather was just too much. So we changed it. And here is one. 
she is allowing her to show some skin but she's not going too crazy she ain't going too crazy with it that is something simple so she was like you know what hey if you want to go that simple fine by me and then the next one that we changed we only changed these two so and then this is the next one and i think that that looks absolutely gorgeous on our girl she's so pretty though she's so pretty and now she's about to be a mama so yeah anyway she she better be happy and my girl is over here she's just so sad she's just <laughs> come and sit over here by your mama like girl try to cheer her up try to do something like your mama just don't know what to do with herself okay so they need to just have a heart to heart but like you know what i'm really upset i'm disappointed with you right now but it is gonna be okay And we're going to get through this. So tell her we're going to get through this. Do we not have any more interactions? Um, Ask a Taina on siblings, baby. Look how many she got. Look how many she got. Okay. Hug her lovingly. And just tell her that everything will be fine. That you're going to be here for her. And all that good stuff. Like, you know that I love you. I'm doing this for your own good. And everything will be fine. You know that, right? She's like, I know. She's like, yes, I know, mom. I know. She's like, and I'm going to try. I'm going to try my best to do better and to listen to what you got to say. She's like, well, sometimes it's just hard because I want to do what I want to do. Okay, y'all, but anyway, before these two get into it and have their little heart to heart, I think right there is a good place to go ahead and wrap up this episode. I definitely hope that you guys enjoyed it. Miss Taina got a long little road ahead of her. I think in the next episode, we're going to go ahead and talk to Tiana and tell Tiana about the baby. You know, we couldn't bring Tiana into all this drama because she did just give birth. So we're letting her heal and spend some time with her baby over there and spend some time with Justin. So we didn't want her to get all into the crazy drama mess that's going on over here with uh, Taina just yet. But Taina is definitely going to need her big sister to talk talk her through some things so uh tiana will more than likely be in the next episode i can't wait my girl ain't been in this episode since she moved out <laughs> but anyway so we already figured that drew was gonna um get into it with dion even though we had to do that twice because the first time he lost so we just gonna forget the first time we just gonna ignore that and I wanted Omar over there, but Omar decided not to come because him and Amina is still going through. <sighs> they still just going through it, child. And Amina is getting looks from every direction. So Omar better get his acting together, okay? Because the first Miles was a stalker, but the second Miles with the eye. Okay, his name is M-I-L-E-S. The second one, the first one was M-Y. So I mean, hey. Hey. Omar better get herself together because I'm a little sick of trying to get these two on the same page. Like they literally just continue to get worse. Everybody keeps saying, try, try, try. But bro, we've been trying <laughs> and it's just getting worse. But I get it. Marriage is about to give or take. It's about going through all the rough patches and coming out on the other side. So I'm trying my best to stick with it, y'all. But Omar and Amina better get themselves together because it's not about to get no easier, especially with Taina being pregnant and about to bring a baby in this house. It's about to get even crazier because we don't have room. Like we bought this house, then Tiana moved out. And when Tiana moved out, we had plenty of room. Now we are literally about to run out of room again. <sighs> but we ain't moving. This is going to be the house. So we just going to have to make it do what it do and just move things how we can. But anyway, you know, y'all know me. I, I start talking, then I start rambling all of my ideas out, but I can't do that. So I definitely hope that you guys enjoyed. Make sure to leave some comments down below. Hit the subscribe button, please. It would mean so much to me. I really appreciate it. Um, I always do this. Let's start this again. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button and that post notification bell. And I will see you guys next week with a brand new episode. Bye guys.